Alright, Twitter artists have got to be some of the craziest people I know. They willingly choose to use a website that goes against everything they do creatively, and whenever they mention commissions or sales, they basically have to use lead speak or risk having Twitter hide their tweets. And it really sucks too because some of the most talented people I know, I discovered on this cesspool of a website after spending hours and hours looking for a unique style. And honestly, that's what I love about them. Despite all odds, a lot of artists keep making stuff on Twitter. And sometimes, just sometimes, they get the algorithm on their side, and I really love it. Prime examples of some really good artists that I've been working with lately is Citrus, who's been making me new character stills and thumbnails for my channel for the last few months. And most recently, Moontoon, who's been making me new thumbnails, and also some really cool animations. However, when I'm not seeking out an artist to commission, artists are usually looking for me. Enter VJ. He's been a very good friend of mine who makes some really amazing artwork. And when the planets align just right, she gets an idea and makes me fan art. So, what happens when you give a bunny too much free time in a drawing tablet? Now, to be clear, this isn't my first piece of fan art I've received, but this was the start of a trend that would probably be my downfall. Anyway, here's just a sample of what V has made me. Weeks later, I make a new friend, Volfen. Once again, another really talented artist who makes all sorts of cool drawings and small animations. But upon seeing VJ's art, they decided to add fuel to the fire and DM me on Discord. Now, while my Discord account is public, I don't normally answer DMs since most conversations turn out like this. So let me simulate what happened after I accepted their request. Nope. You bitch. <laughs> the fuck? And just like that, I somehow became mommy material. Not to be outdone, soon comes along Maxine. She's another good artist who makes really nice pinup art, and, well, being friends with Volfin, this happens. <laughs> Mind you, this is only like two days apart, I think. And once I'm done panicking over that, soon comes along Cleo. And then finally, <laughs> respect. We're going to hell for this. <laughs> Where did this come from? This can't be up here. To be clear, I love all this art I've been getting. And honestly, I'm really flattered people even take the time to do this. There are many more talented people I don't have time to mention today, unfortunately. But let me know if you want a part two and maybe I'll look into featuring more artists. If you're interested in any of my friends' art, their accounts are in the description below. And as always, a big thanks to my wonderful Patreon and Kofi supporters for helping fund the videos I make. Uh, I've been kind of going through a rough patch lately in editing, but I thought I'd just make this short little fun video to give a shout out to some of my friends and just shed some light on how silly it is, as I got some cool videos coming out soon. So stay tuned, and remember, stay foxy. Morbid thought.